For three straight days now, the seven judges of the Supreme Court have been hearing the 2022 presidential election petition, which is challenging the victory of President-elect William Ruto, who was declared the winner of the August 9 polls by the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission Chairperson of Fula Chepukati on August 15th. Well, during this period, the judges were treated to arguments from a battery of lawyers who submitted compelling evidence as to why the election on the other hand and should be upheld well on the other hand as well the election of president elect Ruto should be nullified as Miola Omoja leader Raila Odinga who is the principal petitioner in this case pleaded with a Martha Kome led bench to nullify the election in its entirety citing massive irregularities on the other hand Ruto who is defending his victory urged the court to uphold his victory insisting that the over 14 million voters, considering he got 7.1 million voters, the 7.1 million voters made their choice and elected him in the hotly contested polls. Well, the judges have now retreated to go and write their verdict, which will be, which they will render on Monday to Kenyans to either uphold or nullify the election. Well, it is not over until it is over and that is when the judges will come back here on Monday to render their verdict. But until then, be sure to subscribe to our news website by going to www.capitalfm.co.ke forward slash news. My name is Davis Ayega.